Speaker of the House Nancy Pelosi has had enough of this crap. Donald Trump's newly hand-picked Attorney General William Barr falsely characterized the Mueller report over the weekend, and Trump's Republican House allies have spent the week using Barr's disingenuous summary to try to punish those who have dared to expose Trump's scandals. Now Pelosi is coming out swinging.as for William Barr's four-page summary of the Mueller report, which is now known to contain at least 300 pages of evidence about Donald Trump's scandals, Pelosi isn't having any of it. She's slamming Barr's actions as arrogant and condescending and she's throwing her full weight behind the brewing legal fight to force the entire Mueller report to become public. House Democrats have a number of options available, including subpoenaing the report itself, subpoenaing Barr, and subpoenaing Mueller. As for William Barr's four-page summary of the Mueller report, which is now known to contain at least 300 pages of evidence about Donald Trump's scandals, Pelosi isn't having any of it. She's slamming Barr's actions as arrogant and condescending and she's throwing her full weight behind the brewing legal fight to force the entire Mueller report to become public. House Democrats have a number of options available, including subpoenaing the report itself, subpoenaing Barr, and subpoenaing Mueller. Meanwhile, the Republicans on the House Intelligence Committee are making the bizarre demand that Chairman Adam Schiff resign because he's spent the past two years pointing to the abundance of Trump-Russia collusion evidence that's been in plain sight. Schiff isn't going anywhere as the Republicans don't have the numbers to oust him. Nancy Pelosi, who would make any final call about Schiff's fate, is coming out strongly in his support. She's slamming the Republicans on the committee, calling them scaredy cats who just don't know what to do. Even as the Trump bar cover-up of the Mueller report continues to show more cracks by the hour, it's clear that Nancy Pelosi and the House Democrats are going to keep hammering away at exposing the truth, no matter what Donald Trump and the Republicans might throw at them.